motherfucker is you versus you. Look in the mirror, motherfucker is you versus you. Look in the mirror, motherfucker is you versus you. Yo, 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 what up, YouTube? Welcome to CN Take, man. My name is JCN. Coming back with another one, man. Y'all already know the most hot and woke us up today. Let's take this opportunity to be great. You know what I'm saying? Let me show y'all what it looked like out here real quick, though. You know, we got another beauty. We got another beautiful day. You know, I was off today, so I got a lot of things done. I still got to kick back, but I got a lot of shit done, you know? And for y'all, man, whenever you get a chance to get ahead of things, you know what I'm saying? To get the ball rolling on something, do that. You know what I mean? Instead of procrastinating, I know you want to chill out, you want to relax, it's your day off. I get that. You know what I'm saying? You could still do that too, but get a few things done in between that could put you ahead. Remember that, man. It's always a good feeling to get some stuff done that you probably been putting to the back burner, sitting to the side, or if you don't even got nothing like that and you know that you got to do something the next day and you get a little bit of time, man, do that shit because that opened up more, that opened up more space for you to do what you want. So do what you got to do right now. So you could do what you want to do later. Do what you got to do right now so you could do what you want to do later. You know what I mean? But I had to show y'all that clip from LeBron James. I know it was quick, so I just repeated it a couple times because it really is you versus you. You know, nobody else. People fuck up because they tend to compare themselves to other people. They tend to watch what everybody else is doing instead of being focused on them. Instead of being focused on that person that's in the mirror, bro. It really is you versus you. You know what I mean? We strive to be the best version of ourselves. We want to do and be better than the person we was yesterday. And the only way you can do that is by making forward progress. Not taking steps backwards all the time. Yeah, we fall off, but you got to know how to get back up and not be doing that shit all the time. So you get better when you do that. When you get you get better when you tend to fight some of that old shit that pull you back. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, you fall down, but guess what? When you start limiting those falls, when you start limiting those relapses, when you start limiting those fuck-ups, those steps backwards, bro, listen, dog, you only get better. And then before you know it, you completely wipe that old behavior out. You completely wipe those mistakes out. You completely wipe all of that shit out, bro, because you kept going. You know what I mean? You striving to be better than who you was yesterday. Not be that same person that you was yesterday and the day before that and the day before that and then the month before that, the year before that. Listen, bro, that's where people get it. They, they get it all messed up because while you watching everybody else and you not competing with yourself, you still sitting there the same. You in the same position with the same ass attitude, with the same energy, with the same problems, bruh. Not going anywhere because you're not challenging yourself. You know what I mean? And when, listen, bro, this journey, bro, listen, discipline plays a big part in this shit. So when you have these urges, bro, when you got shit pulling away at you, you got to be disciplined in that shit. You know, you got to be able to challenge yourself in that shit. And don't be afraid of the challenges either. Don't run from your problems either, bro. You mess up running from your problems, bro, because them problems don't go nowhere. You know what I mean? Life ain't going nowhere, not right now, bro. So you got to understand, you got to get, you got to keep pushing it forward because life going to happen no matter what. The sun going to rise, the sun going to set. You know what I mean? The world going to turn, bro. But guess what, dog? Understand, bro, you got to be out here staying active, doing something, bro, because life ain't going to stop because you got problems, bro. Life ain't going to stop, so you got to continue to fight, bro. You got to continue to challenge yourself. You got to continue to motherfucking be able to be disciplined out here while you moving forward. Because there's so much temptation around, it's not even funny, bro. And I've been, and this is the crazy part, even just sitting here today, because I went to the gym this morning, but since I got home, I haven't moved. You know what I mean? Meaning I haven't went anywhere else. I ran to the dumpster. That was about it. But one of the hardest things to do is fast while you at home because guess what? The kitchen is right there. You know what I mean? But I did it one time to where I was at home and I didn't eat nothing at all. Because it's it usually is a challenge when you fasting and then you at home. It took me one time to actually be successful in that. And today I haven't touched nothing. 
I haven't touched nothing. It took that one time where I was like, you know what? I ain't go, you know, I know I'm at home, but guess what? I'm, I can beat this. You know, I can beat this. I can, I, I, I'm going to challenge myself to not eat nothing while I'm here because I always fail. But I put my foot down and guess what? This is the second time I did this shit. I had just started my life. Damn, you know what? You didn't touch nothing. You stuck to the script, didn't do none of that shit, bro. Didn't go to the kitchen, didn't go get nothing to eat, didn't go snack, didn't do none of that shit, bro. I haven't ate anything, bro, so I stuck with my fast. All I did was drink my gallon of water. You know, so you get better when you challenge yourself, when you accept these issues that you have and you try to fix that shit. Not sweep it under the rug, bro. You got to challenge yourself out here. You know what I'm saying? You got to challenge yourself to do right. How you going to get better if you ain't challenging yourself to do right? You know what I'm saying? Now you going to be walking around called can't get right. Y'all seen life, bro. Some of y'all motherfuckers is some can't get right motherfuckers because you keep repeating the same mistakes. You know what I mean? You got the same problems, bro. You ever hear motherfucker that got the same problems? Like, bro, I don't want to hear that shit. You know what I'm saying, bro? This is the same problem. You have more than enough time to figure this out. It's because you're not challenging yourself. You know, you keep having these issues because you're not challenging yourself. You can't elevate because you're not challenging yourself. You're not pushing that up button on your life because you're not challenging yourself. You know what I'm saying? You keep running into the same walls, the same problems, the same issues because you keep doing the same thing with the same attitude and your ass getting the same results. So switch some shit up. We had to switch shit up. When we came over here, we made a decision like, listen, bro, I'm switching shit up. I ain't about to be just sitting here stuck low on energy, not moving forward in my life. You know what I mean? Sitting around like a loser, not doing nothing. Like a lot of motherfuckers like we see, bro. We ain't doing that shit. Because all of us have examples that the Most High put in front of our face. I want you to understand. The Most High got so many examples that he put in front of our face. So many clues. But we don't be picking up on that shit. Some motherfuckers be in denial. They'll cover their own eyes up. I don't want to see it. Okay, then. Don't see it then. Act like you don't see what's going on around you, bro. You know what I'm saying? Act like you don't see it, but don't be complaining when you a part of the problem, when your ass is out there doing that same shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because you don't want to see what's going on when the most high putting these clues in front of your face, when he putting these examples in front of your face, and you mean to tell me you want to join that? Okay, then go ahead. You know what I'm saying? But we got to be out here learning from not only our mistakes, but from the things that we see, the people that we see, the stuff that they done been through. That's why it's great knowledge when you hear it's, it's like one of the best services you can do when you see more and more people that's documenting some of the things and trying to help people out because they telling the story of, of shit that a lot of people going through. But where would I be if I'm just sitting around, just keeping all of this to myself, keeping the knowledge that I know, you know, about addiction, you know what I mean? Just keeping that to myself about my struggles, you know, relationship issues, you know what I mean? Being low on masculinity, low on confidence, all of those things that I didn't have to endure, you know what I'm saying? That we still fighting against right now. You know what I'm saying? So if I'm not talking about it, then it's probably somebody out there that don't even know that could be going through the same thing, bro. And that's the same with your life, too. That's why I say, bro, you have to be an example. Right now, you are an example of a lot of people that you don't even know is watching you. It's people paying attention. It's people that seeing you elevate in your life and they can't even they don't even know what you did. All they do is they just watching, bro. You will you'll be surprised how many motherfuckers is some watching ass people. It's people that watch and look at everybody, whether you at work, at the gym, if you go to a same, the same establishment all the time, bro, they seeing you. They seeing the muscle that you gaining. They probably seeing the weight that you losing. They probably seeing the glow that you have. They probably seeing the smile that you got. They probably seeing that skin that you got. They probably see the new attitude that you got. They see everything, bro. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I tell y'all that this shit is a lot bigger than us. You know what I'm saying? It's us versus us, but it's still a lot bigger than that, bro. You know what I mean? Your elevation really means something. That's why I say you got to be on your purpose because listen, bro, no matter what your purpose is, bro, you going to know what it is. That vision is up here, bro. God needs you to do that. 
because you don't know how many people you could possibly be helping out. So that's why he bless you when you on your purpose. That's why he bless you when you working towards things. That's why he bless you when you show gratitude for your life. You know what I'm saying? Because you really not flushing your life down the toilet, bro. You done been through the darkness. You done had your experiences. And now you lifting yourself back up and praising him at the same time, bro. Listen, you are highly favored right now. Understand that you are highly favored. So you got this push. You got everything pulling for you, bro. The only motherfuckers that's not pulling for you is these demons, these haters, these succubus women, and, 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 and these motherfucking elites and all that other bullshit that's out here trying to keep us down. So understand, bro, all you need is the most high and some good energy people in your life that's, that, 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 that know your worth, know your value. Because you know your value now. When you got all of that around you, bro, listen, you got more than enough to succeed. Understand, you got more than enough to succeed. No more excuses. It's you versus you. So when you look in that mirror, bro, understand that, listen, I ain't got nobody else to worry about. I ain't got to be trying to compete with motherfuckers around me. We already know. That's why so many haters around because they steady competing and watching everybody else, bro. Listen, when you don't do that, when you don't pay attention to that, bro, listen, dog, you, you move up faster than anybody else because you not watching. You just focused on you. This is what this journey do. So while they doing all of that, bro, all you doing is climbing up. All you doing is moving up in this world, bro. Because motherfuckers, man, listen, dog. All they want to do is just watch everybody else. You just watching you. Because you know that, listen, dog. You the one that make the ultimate decisions in your life. So when you mess up, it's because of, of, of a decision that you made. When you take steps backwards, it's because of a decision that you made. You know what I mean? When you not elevating out here, it's because of the decisions that you making. So when you could get a hold of that shit, bro, I'm telling you, bro, man, listen, bro. Get ready to shoot to the stars because that's the only thing that's going to happen to you. That's the only thing that's going to happen to you, bro, is you rising out here. You know what I mean? You doing, man, you living an abundant lifestyle out here. That's what happens. You know what I mean? That's what happens, bro. These things is, and these blessings going to be coming at you tenfold. You, you damn near ain't going to even be knowing what you do to the, did to deserve the blessings that you got. But you focused on you. That's what you did. You know what I mean? You got on your purpose. That's what you did. You know what I mean? You show love to the most high and praise the most high. That's what you did. You know what I mean? You ain't just stay stuck. Stay doing the same shit. Hell no. Nah. You made some big changes. So get ready for the big blessings that's about to happen to you. For real, all right? And that's my word, man. My name is and The CN Take. Holla at y'all later, man. Peace. First, I'm going to get on my grind. Then second, stop wasting my time. On shit less important. If ain't about money, I'm going the other direction. And third, I'm going to do what I got to to eat. Fourth, I'ma sew up the streets. Fifth, I'ma never quit dropping this heat. So as long as I'm breathing, you better get used to me. Sixth, I'ma get